speaking of being prepared, our, I know our next group, they're, they're, they're prepared. They've been preparing for, for years. And they've been preparing under, um, you know, Mr. David Boxley. And before we go this route, we've got another announcement, and it looks like a little girl. So this little girl here looks like she's about four, maybe, but she's looking for a grandma. So if somebody can cast their eyes and... I believe she said Leandra. So Leandra's looking for a grandmother. She'll be here with Lee. Lee's pretty easy to find. Um, and so, so thank you. Other business to take care of here. I did receive one more um, mem uh, memorial donation. This one is for Bertina E. Brendable from Metlet Catla. And it's from her sister and nephews, Emily, Jerry Jr., Charles, and Stephen Bennett. So thank you. Um, and thank everybody else for all the donations in, in memory. This is the last show. Um, if I don't make it up here by the end of the night, I want to make sure everybody gets the message to get home safely, um, be nice to each other. And, and I know this last one is um, one that we've all been ready and, and raring for. And I'm not going to take up any more of their time. So um, please help me welcome Get Home.
That was for you, you guys. The people of the salmon. We are all people of the salmon. Why what? Get on the way to hook meal go guata. Lua am go go oru. Dem will heitka a het achkesim. En lua am go go oru. Ada adzik si go oru. Dem will needs a chani snusim. Dem will go ek si guata. Dem will needs a go will a law get on. Ada go will a law tsim sian. Do ek si sim. Do ek si sim. Chani snusim. Thank you all very much. It's awesome. The last thing I said was hot in here, huh? <laughs> but I'm happy to see all your beautiful faces and your spirit. You feed us with your spirit. We're proud to be here. We're fortunate. Thank you. The next song we're going to be doing for you, as I've said in the past, is our only old song. This song was written hundreds of years ago on the, among our people in British Columbia. This is a chief's welcome or chief's headdress dance in which we spread the down. And this is one of the only places that we ever perform where you never have to tell people what the down is for. And that's very cool. These young men are not chiefs, but they are wearing the regalia of chiefs, the headdresses. And the down that's being put there is, a, is the peace between our people and all of you. The honor that we pay you. These boys represent the four clans of the Simsian.
Doexism, Doexism. Really proud of all of our Simsian dancers that, that came from home and from Anchorage. Happy to represent with you. Thank you very much for singing with us for the grand entry and please come back and rescue us for the grand exit. The next song we're going to do for you was written by this uh, sometime model. She was in the, mod in the show today, in the fashion show. Her name is Alison Bremner. She's from Yakutat. She wrote this song, presented it to my son and I. This song is an honor song, honors the people of this land, this land. The Klingit people, the Auk people. These four young men, actually four and a half young men, represent the four clans. They, the staffs they carry represent the four clans of our people. They're, this is not a warrior song, this is an honor song to honor our hosts of this land. <sighs> Two years goes by really fast. Sheesh. That, uh, that salmon that you saw at the beginning, as far as I know, it's the largest mask ever danced on this stage, so we're happy about that. But the idea for that mask came two years ago when I was on the stage during our last performance, so we've been working on getting that ready for you for two years. For you. The next song we're going to do for you is called Walking in the Footsteps. Our women are going to sing this, are going to dance. We're going to sing for them. They're preparing a way for the young, the next generation, clearing the path for the next generation so the next gener generation can run on that path.
Anybody? Up local. A yelkenum. At a attic sagorum. The hoople glutter. The willard arco. Dim haitku. Hats arcusum. At a get on. Tarco dim. Needs it, And now I can see you all. <laughs> Thank you for being here. It's really an honor and a uh, privilege to be able to be in front of you and dance for you. This next song is the Raven Song. This was written by Christine Martin from Vancouver, BC, to honor her uncle Murray Smith, Shemwagat Al Gamcha, Chief Al Gamcha, from the village of Loch Lambs. And uh, this is for all the Ravens in the crowd. Come on, let me hear it, Ravens. Come on. Wait, what? You ever seen a duck on a lake just kind of gliding smoothly along? You don't see his paddling feet under there going 60 miles an hour. That's what it's like on the other side of that curtain. We might seem smooth, but ho. Oh. That's why I'm taking a deep breath here for a second. The next song we're going to do for you is about Raven. 
Raven was a magical creature who could change his shape. Raven was responsible for a lot of good. Hello? Yeah. Hey, we're right in the middle of a performance. What? Really? Well, where are you? You're serious, right? Okay, come here. Sorry about this, folks. You're sure about this, huh? to explain that. I'm going to explain it by saying, one, it is only the second social commentary that I've ever done in all the songs I've written. And second, the words say, the cell phone has taken is your boss. The second line, ni ni skutu itska gadit na dedulsum. He has taken, or na gagoatsum, he has taken your mind. <laughs> the last one is, gorum di dubum geun awul wagagoatsum. What are you going to do without your mind? Mouse Woman was a magical creature who could change her shape. In the stories of our people, all of our three tribes, Mouse Woman would often come to the rescue and try to give good advice to the so-called men heroes of our 
That's not her down there. <laughs> anyway, she uh, would try to give good advice. And in this story, Mouse Woman tries to give good advice to a fisherman, a warrior, and a berry picker to warn them of the evil cannibal giant, Baush, who was terrorizing the countryside. <laughs> the words translated are, Mouse Woman knows what men will do. Mouse Woman knows what the spirits will do. Those who listen will live long and prosper. Those who don't will suffer and die. Mouse Woman knows what men will do. I'm going to back up a little so you guys can see a little bit better over here. Maybe. If not, oh well, look at the screen. <laughs> Gidhon, people of the salmon, of which most of you are, we feel akin to you. We feel honored to represent the Simsian, Haida, and Clinket, no matter where we go. We've been fortunate that way. The people in my dance group are not just Simsian, they are also Clinket and Haida. The Somalia you hear, the language is because their leader is. Simsian and uses the language. But we are very proud to stand in this best arena, this best venue for our people and sing for you and dance for you. I'm going to have to wait until we get the uh, CDs so I can see that first song we had to sing from behind as part of the part of the magic, you know to, But I, I want to see that uh, salmon come out of there Come up the crick <laughs> Maybe it's going to be my favorite song, but the one we're going to do next Is definitely my favorite of all the songs that we've ever put together. This is called deer song It's also called the gift of the little doe. You'll see why. I a a I a a I a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a
I am hunting deer. This is how we hunt deer in California. A, there are a lot of hunters in this room. Raise your hand if that's ever happened to you. <laughs> Nobody wants to fess up. Um, we're sure enjoying ourselves. Um, Thank you for being the best audience we've ever danced for. We've been everywhere, been to Italy. It doesn't matter. This place is always the best. You know why? Because you're our people. That's why. 
This next song we're going to do is called Eagle and Young Chief. The story goes that there was a young man walking on the beach near his village, and he heard a rustling in the bushes. And he went over and he saw there was this big eagle caught in a fishnet. And he took his knife and he very gently cut the net open and the big eagle flew away, his big wings. <laughs> Years passed and that young man grew up and became chief of his village. And his village suffered a terrible famine. They didn't have enough food to last but a few days. He didn't know what they were going to do for the winter. And he was walking on that same beach wondering, what do I do? How do I help my people? Just then a live salmon dropped from the sky at his feet. And he looked up and he saw that big eagle flying away. What he didn't know is that eagle was a knock knock, a supernatural being. And he'd come back all those years later to repay that young man's kindness. And every day after that, he brought bigger and bigger animals, eventually brought a whale to feed that village. One of my favorite stories when I was a little boy. I want to take a quick second. I know that's a heavy mask. Sorry, Dar. Um, my dad has led this dance group now for 20 years. And, and there isn't a, a Simpson group here that he doesn't have some part, whether it's writing songs or making masks or some influence at all. Since 1982, since that first potlatch he gave, where he got that name, Skolgeal, first potlatch. He's been a leader for our people, and all he's ever wanted is for us to be proud and us to have this. And we have it, don't we? So, while Git Hoan will be planning something else for our 20th anniversary, I wanted to uh, give my dad a little gift just to thank him for the life that I've had and what he's given to not only this dance group, but Fourth Generation and Simsian Hayuk and everybody else that has something to do with Simsian people. Uh, it's, I've got this neck ring for him for right now. Because he deserves it. And this story is an example for all of us. I grew up hearing it from him. Let's treat everyone good. What you do comes back to you. This is the Eagle and Young Chief.
you. Um, I'd like to real quickly thank Lipkinim Gamil Gordon, fourth generation dancers to my Gidleik Ox. Who am I forgetting? Gidgel Howley. Uh, for joining us for grand entry. I said, uh, it was really important to us, one, because there's few of us, but two, and more importantly, uh, our people mean the world to us. And I live in Metlakatla now, but most of us live in Seattle and we're separated from that homeland. And, and you all being up here with us both Wednesday night and tomorrow and during the parade really means the world to us. Um, Metlakatla is home, and uh, we appreciate you all very much, and we love you for it. And I just want to acknowledge uh, the fellow who wrote the song that'll be sung tomorrow night, Gavin Hudson, if you're in the room somewhere, you want to wave your hand or stand up or something. He's right over there. The song he wrote, uh, yeah, I'm sure you've listened to it online. It's beautiful. Um, the song is all about we need to fill the air with our language so people can hear it and that we can, we can do it. We can speak our language and we can bring them back to a continuation for generations to come. So uh, this is our opportunity to acknowledge him and thank him for letting us use his song for this. And uh, we're not quite done yet. Thank you very much. You know, uh, is, is that the official row right there for Seal Alaska? Albert, how come you're sitting over there? <laughs> anyway, I'm just kidding. I just noticed something. That clock stopped at 23 minutes about 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs> We're almost through. Gides of Gaudium. Long time ago. Our people, our people were strong. They had a connection with nature. Then something happened. Strangers came and said, this is no longer yours. You can never be what you were before. And that was a terrible time for our grandparents, great grandparents and grandparents. Our parents had to suffer through that, the results of that. But now, you saw all the, even the little toddlers uh, fashion show and the, these little guys here, these future, future dancers and drummers. Every, every dance group has young people in the, in the groups now. Things have changed, haven't they? This song, this song is the story of what I've just told you. It's called Noom Noel. It belongs to us. I dedicate, we dedicate this song, everybody from right there all the way to right there. All of you. This song is called Noom Noel. It belongs to us.
One dancer left. One small thread of a once powerful rope that held our people together. Every time we sing, every time we dance, every time we use our language, the rope gets stronger, the rope gets thicker. Lick skedum getting gwenids and dim lachtagum. Lick skedum getting without hi 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 We're finished. We're going to do our traveling song, which was written by my son David. The translation is, I will follow this road wherever it leads, through good or bad, till I reach its end. That is the journey of our culture, through good or bad, until we reach its end. I don't want this, even, I don't want this to end, actually. This is too much fun. Oh yeah, hi, uh, oh yeah. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.
Nation. And to our visitors, thank you very much. From the bottom of our hearts, that means more to us than we can ever tell you, okay? And we hope, we hope that your enthusiasm only makes you want to go home and work hard too. Because all that matters is that this group of people Keep doing what we're doing. There is nothing more important in the whole world than us speaking our languages and being who we are. There is nothing more important than that. Thank you all so very much. I would like to right now invite whatever Simpsons are capable to either come up to the sides, a couple of you maybe on the stage, and we do one last song that everybody knows. One more round of applause for Git Hone, our lead dance group.